Hey everybody, Jason here with Trendify, and today I'm going to talk about the big mistakes that people make when they first sign up for a high-level SaaS account and what you can do to avoid them. Now, before we get started, I just want you to know that we have a link down below to get a free 30-day trial with High Level using my link. It's ghlfree.com, ghlfree.com. You can click the link down below. That will give you a full 30-day trial to the Agency Pro version. Again, if you have any concerns about the $4.97 a month price tag that comes with it, I want you to know. Watch my videos. I'll show you how to get more clients. But if you are at the end of your trial and you feel like you still aren't ready for that $4.97 a month, you can easily downgrade to either $2.97 or even $97 per month and go on some of the lower tiers till you get comfortable. But hopefully watching my videos will get you through to profitability quickly so that you can start building your SaaS company and figuring out what niche you want to go into. So let's get into the list of what I think are some big mistakes that people have when they first start going into high level as a SaaS agency owner. All right, so mistake number one is taking too long to set up your branding. And what I mean by that is taking too long to figure out what your domain name is going to be, what your SaaS company is going to be called, what your branding is going to look like, your logo and all of that. Just know that you can set this up very quickly. It doesn't have to be your lifetime decision. I've changed my SaaS name several times. I've changed my domain name several times. It's very easy to do, but don't spend too long on this, but you do need to get it set up, right? So pick a domain name, go and register it on GoDaddy, figure out what your software is going to be called, and then go to a site like Canva. You can see here, if we go here and type in logo and click search, this does, I believe, require the pro version, but uh, I've gotten a lot of really cool, let's do software logo. You can see there's a ton of really cool uh, techie looking uh, templates here. You can just go and click on any of these and start building it out. So figure this one. I'll just show you. Customize this template. And it has a cool uh, logo here. You can change the background color if you want to make a, a black background one too. Whatever you want to do. Let's say I was calling this plussoft.com or whatever. And then I make the font a little smaller. Delete this. Bam. I have a uh, software logo. Now I may not use this one, but I just want you to see, you can change the colors of this. They make them really easy to edit. So just know it's super easy to do and you shouldn't have to spend too much time. You can change your logo at any time. You can change your domain name at any time, but just get something set up so that you can feel legitimate and you can start telling people that you have a company. Mistake number two is offering too many options. There are so many things that high level can do that I myself fell victim to this. I started getting so excited that it can do emails and social media and it can do text messages and all your communication in one place and it has websites and course builders and domains and all kinds of crazy stuff that you could build inside of this and I started offering everything to everybody and the big mistake was that a lot of times they didn't quite understand what it was and they weren't that excited about it but because I was excited about it and I promised it to them now I had to go and build out 10 different things for somebody that probably would have been happy with just a website and a chat widget and maybe getting some reviews and I could have done that in maybe three minutes of setup versus offering all these other things and now I have to maintain all those. So my advice to you is start small, find one or two features that you can really confidently speak about. You Maybe you've tested them out on your own business or you have a friend that you've just tried it out on, really quickly got comfortable with how to present it and then start offering just that, just the websites, just the reviews, just the social media planner. Get some clients flowing in with just those services and then you can expand as you get comfortable with the new features. But I promise you, you don't need to offer every single feature to every Every customer, you're going to spend way too much time setting that up and they don't even care about all of it in the first place. The third big mistake is not making any offers. So having the free trial, like with my link, GHL free, you get a free 30 day trial to the software. And I find that people don't make any offers. They set it up once, uh, but they don't actually go out and find any clients. They don't ever talk to anybody about the software and they get to the end of the trial and they say, this doesn't work. Start again, find a simple software, a simple solution that you can offer to somebody and just start pitching it to people. Put it on your Facebook page, put it in Facebook groups, cold call a few people, send some cold emails, send some DMs on Instagram, whatever you got to do to just see if you can get some interest. Offer a free website, offer a free trial, get some money flowing, get some interest flowing 
and it'll be able to help you build experience with real actual potential clients versus theory and watching YouTube videos, which I appreciate you watching mine, but you don't have to spend hours and hours researching. You can start actually pitching things to clients and see if it works. That leads me to number four, spending too much time in research mode. So we can spend all this time watching 5,000 YouTube videos and reading all these blog posts and all that is very helpful and it builds encouragement, but do that in your downtime, like at night or early in the morning when you're having your coffee. But during the day, in the first 30 days, if you need to make this work in the first 30 days, then you need to be pitching the product because most people can't buy from you if they don't know about it. So just making offers, it doesn't matter. There are so many businesses that can use this software. The first hundred say no, there's a thousand more right around the corner that might say yes. So don't worry about make, saying the wrong thing, doing the wrong thing. Just be ethical, follow through with what you promise people, but don't worry about making a mistake. It's a brand new company for you. You can even be honest and let them know that. I've just launched this software. I'm looking for beta testers. I've just launched this software. I'm willing to do a free trial just to get it going and see if you like. All those things can be easy and true and legitimate and help you have some flexibility. If you make a few mistakes, they're not going to scream at you. They're not going to put a bad review because you've given them a good deal and you're providing a good service, even a free trial for them. So don't spend too much time in research mode. You need to be in action mode and pitching mode. Mistake number five is spending too much time thinking about what to sell. So again, we've talked about the packages. I'm going to go over to my SaaS and show you my dashboard and talk about it. You don't need to spend too much time thinking about what to sell. All right, here we are in our SaaS configurator and you can see that you can build any kind of package that you want. So if you want everyone to get everything at 97 a month, or you can start dragging these around in the future, they're going to have the ability to have even more than, than three options, but just come up with a simple package. Even if you end up giving them more than you've initially pitched them on, like you just sold them on a website, but you end up throwing in a chat widget and Google reviews, and that's just a bonus for them signing up. That's great too. Start with something very simple. A lot of my clients only pay me for the social media poster just by itself. They don't know that it does websites and funnels and can do two, two way text messaging and all that stuff because they don't care about those features. They only know that they want to get more exposure on social media. They want a tool to be able to do it. And I provide them with the templates and the tool to make their social media consistent. So even that one thing alone, you can offer to somebody. Just find what resonates with you. If offering websites is great, then do that for you. If just doing reviews is something you want to do, then and then do that. You don't have to include everything, but start making offers. The next big mistake people make is not learning how to use the product. You should be logging into your own software and actually playing around with it, actually setting up funnels, actually testing it out on your friends' businesses, learning how to use the software for yourself. Because once you are confident in how to use it, then you can confidently sell it. Go through each feature, play around with it, set it up for yourself, set it up for your own business. If you have a friend or a spouse or a partner or somebody that has a business, see if you can set it up for free for them just to play around and actually test it out on a real business. And once you've tried this out, then you'll get confident how easy it is to set up. It can be very overwhelming at first because there's so many things to click. But once you set it up a few times, you'll be extremely confident that anything that goes wrong or anything that your customer asks, you'll be able to answer or find the answer out, which leads me to my next example of a big mistake people make is not asking for help and not engaging in the group. And by group, there are several groups that you can be a part of, which I'll show you here. Number one is the high level official group, which is right here. There's as of this recording, 29,000 200 members in the group. You have access to this as soon as you sign up for high level and they constantly post new updates about what's going on with the software. People are asking questions. You can go to this little search tab and search just about anything that you want. And there's going to be people chiming in and answering for you. If you were on the 497 pro plan by using my link down below for the free 30 day trial, you also get access to this group, which has almost 4,000 members. These are some of the brightest minds at high level people that have six and seven figure companies that are all in this group, masterminding, sharing ideas, talking about what's working all inside of here. And we constantly have training from high level directly that is in here as well. So you can post your question right here, say, sorry, don't know how this works. How can I get this part set up? And you'll probably get some people chiming in asking uh, how they can help you. Or you can also go through all the support that high level has. They have 24 seven chat support. Sometimes it takes a little while for them to get back to you on that, but they also have daily trainings that are live uh, either in the group or over zoom. And if you log in, you can also speak to somebody over zoom most times of the day. So really good support with high level that you can interact with. A lot of people complain about it, but I honestly have never had a bad experience. I've always gotten my questions answered within at least a day or two, sometimes instantly. So I really think engaging in the group, finding out what's going 
working on, the new features, all the things that you need to be on top of so that when those things launch out, you can be ready to present them to your clients. So engaging in the group is a big thing I see a lot of people not doing. And finally, I talked about support, but that is another big thing is not actually reaching out to support when you need it. In the first 30 days, that is crucial to figure out your system. They provide a free kickoff call for you. So you, as soon as you sign up, you usually get an email from them saying, schedule your onboarding kickoff call. They walk you through the entire system, kind of show you what you have in front of you. And at any point, you can hit this little question mark here. It says need help. And you can access a welcome course, go to the help center. You can go to the Facebook group, which I already mentioned, the uh, high level events, which I'm, which I'm going to share with you, the live chat. You can also call support. And when you click on that high level events, here is a daily calendar of all the things going on every single day for high level. So what is this high level group demo call, high level daily group demo call, affiliate strategy. So if you're an affiliate, you can go there, q and I mean, there is endless supply of support and Q&A and everything. In addition to what I already provide in my group and the high level groups that you are a part of, you have no excuse for not getting your answers for the questions that you have. So my encouragement is to hit the ground running once you get logged in, sign up for the account Yes, get the free 30 day trial again, link down below. But more importantly, once you get going, hit the ground running, don't just dabble with it. Because once you can get the profitability, especially in your first month, then you are free. I've told this several times. I had a few group calls today and I keep saying that I've done everything from Shopify to flipping things on eBay to flipping houses, just about any other kind of legal thing that you can do online. And I have found that high level, either the affiliate program and or selling SaaS is one of the most legitimate, straightforward, above board things that you can do. Business owners need more leads. They need websites. They need to be able to post on social media. All these things solve major problems for business. And we can provide that to them with our own white label branded software. So if you don't know what white label is, it's basically if Netflix would allow me to run it as Jason Flicks and sell it to as many people as I wanted to under my own brand, but they've already done all the programming. They have the technology. I just put my own brand on it and sell it for whatever price I want. That is basically white labeling. High level allows you to do that for one low monthly cost and you can have unlimited clients. It's crazy that they that they allow you to do that, but they do. Take advantage of it. Click the link down below, get a free 30 day trial. And if you have any questions, once you sign up, feel free to reach out to me, leave a comment or join the group and I will help you as much as I can. And there's plenty of other resources to help you as well with all the stuff that high level provides. So if that was a value to you, please subscribe to the channel and I'll talk to you again on the next video. Thanks.